All right, what is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Benny back at it again with the S2K. I'm gonna go ahead and put this stuff down, open the hood, and then I'll explain what we're doing. All right, so let me explain what's going on. Basically, this is the one that I had welded and the welds were ugly. I took took it off, um, grinded it off again, grinded it down all the welds. I marked it up again, I'm gonna tack weld it. And then I marked this up where I want it, tack weld that. And then I'm gonna send it off to go get it welded. Um, and then for this one, this one's gonna be a little bit more complicated, but should not be too hard. But uh, basically, we're gonna run it, run it like right here. Then I got the other pipe. It's gonna go up and then tack weld that, and uh, yeah, it should be good. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Let's see how it goes. Hopefully, I don't fuck up, but I don't think I will. At least I think. Alright you guys, so I got the pipes all welded up and everything, um, tack welded at least, but this is how it's going to be looking. Um, so as you guys know, this one has to go above over here through, like above everything because it can't go out through the back. Um, it can, but it's going to be a lot of work, so I'd rather just do this, um, just get it over with. But I mean, that's how it's looking so far. They're, they're cut up pretty ugly, but they're not gonna be like that. Uh, just, uh, just wait. <laughs> they're not gonna be looking like that. It's gonna look more formal. Right now, this is just the start of it. You know how everything just always the start of it looks ugly. So this will look way better. Um, but for now, uh, yeah. This is how it's looking for now, like I said. And everything's not tied up, so a lot of stuff is like still pretty loose, not, like it's not tight. But yeah, this is, we'll see how it goes. I'm gonna send these off tomorrow or the, the following day to get welded, and then we'll see how that goes. Whew, damn, man. Damn, it is a pain in the ass tech welding these, like, had now, obviously I'm, I'm alone doing it but it's like I have to hold it and try to get it as perfect as I possibly can because I can't do it over here and like it's just harder so eventually hi right, everybody what's up um so it's been almost a week since I've uh, TIG welded those uh, pipes and I sent them off to get welded uh, So right now I'm on my way to pick them up I'm on my way to pick them up. I'm gonna go pick those up and then I'm probably gonna go and try and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and try to test fit them to make sure that they're all perfectly fine, which they should be uh, He had already sent me a picture. They look really good uh, From what I saw he coated them with a um, a high temperature paint uh, but they're, they looked fine on the picture without it uh, but we're gonna go ahead and see those how those look uh, yeah. but yeah I'm pretty excited for that and then I also got to go get the package the sensor for the for the the skunk 2 four bar map sensor that I got delivered to my house I gotta pick that up to my parents house but anyways see you when we get there all right you guys both packages are secured the pipes are right here, I'll show them more in detail right now, but they look amazing, they look really good. But um, head on over to Harbor Freight, I gotta pick up some tools to get this drilling on the hood done. Cause I got the, I got, I finally, I got the hood at the house, just gotta put it on, and then drill some holes, and then make sure everything's fine, and we're good to go. But, 
Yes, we'll take it one step at a time. Let's see how it goes. All right, so we're back with the S2000. Um, this for current state. This thing has just, uh, so it's been getting, we've been getting some rain, so it's getting rained on. So it's just been getting rusty and rusty. So I'm not liking that. I'm gonna have to figure something about out about that because this is no bueno. Good, luckily this is just on the surface. Be able to like brush it off with a wire brush and whatnot. But other than that, I'm just checking around, making sure everything's looking fine, everything's looking perfect. So we're gonna go ahead and test fit everything on right now, see how it looks. Hopefully everything lines up and is uh, perfectly fine. We won't be able to leave them on just because I don't have this correct hood on, but it'll get the work done. Uh, so anyways, let's see how this goes. All right, you guys, so here it is. Here's the final product. It don't look too bad. It don't look too... There's something about this, so this is looking bad. Um, but yeah, look at that, dude. Fucking tits, man. Woo. Sheesh. So I am gonna get these wrapped, but I'm gonna make sure before I get them wrapped where they're gonna pop out through the hood. See, I wish I would have put this one closer, but this is on me because I should have extended this or made it to where it's like closer, but it's fine. It's fine for now. This thing all looks still super crazy with the whole pipe going above everything. Everything just looks a little like from there all the way down here, all the piping looks super crazy, which uh, is fine with me because uh, it makes it gives it more of a look to the car, which is really cool. But everything this is turning out turning out great so far. Uh, I do got one more thing to add though, which is this bad boy right here. This is the last piece to the puzzle right here. This thing, once we put it on, woo! Woo, you guys get ready, get ready, get motherfucking ready. This is probably one of the easiest things to install, but if you need some help installing it, or I mean, if you're looking for something, I can kind of give you an example of how to do it. So basically just two bolts, they come out, and then there's this gasket right here you want to get that gasket pull it out and then put it in with a new one as you can see over time this thing becomes flat you don't want to reuse the gasket because then you could get a leak or something car could not be running right and then just put this back like so then put the bolts back on and you're good to go Whew. and just like that it's installed the last piece to the puzzle hey guys i've said it before and i'm gonna keep saying it again well, we're like at the, we're like moments. We're moments away from putting this thing. I gotta put the wheels back on with the rims. That's already good to go. Um, but I'm gonna, I have a checklist. I'm gonna go over the checklist, make sure everything's good. Um, I think there's a couple things I need to do, uh, which is the battery terminal. I need to get that. That's what I need to get today. I forgot about it. Um, what else? Uh, I think a couple other things. Oh, I need to make a plate for this thing back there. So yes, I have a list. I'm gonna go over that list, make sure everything's fine. And also I'm gonna go um, replace a couple parts here and there that need to be replaced. But other than that, fuck. There we have it. I'm still gonna also do a wire, uh, uh, a tuck with the brakes. I'm still gonna do that. Um, but fuck, shit. I don't know what more to say. All right, you guys, so I finished up with the car. Uh, but yes, like I said, we're getting closer. We're only getting closer and closer and closer, uh, which is really cool. Um, but other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video for today. Thanks, you guys, for watching. Uh, also, don't forget to check out the shop online. Click links down below to get your merch today. Uh, but anyways, thank you guys for watching. Peace out. See you in the next one.